Welcome to My Music Presents, your chance to get up close and personal with My Music's favorite artists. This week, Joseph Vincent stops by to play some songs off his new album, answer some of your questions, and tie up some loose ends in my favorite challenge. Hey, what's going on, you guys? My name is Joseph Vincent, and you're watching My Music Presents. This song is called Blue Skies. Joseph, when I first heard you were coming to the show today, I wanted to do something that would succinctly encapsulate your amazing career trajectory. All right, go on. Well, I decided to make you a flow chart. I'll admit it's not my best work, but it gets the job done, wouldn't you say? It's time for crowd surfing, where I'll ask Joseph some of your questions. But first, I have some inquiries of my own. Shoot. What's going on with the wardrobe here? Did <laughs> Are you trying to match me? Because it's I, it's a very close. It's, it's like it's kind of like a mirror situation going on. That just I'm sorry. It's, it's like looking into a weird version of me. <laughs> I'm fairly new to YouTube popularity. I don't quite get it, but Enlighten me, what's the best part of being a successful artist on YouTube, Joseph? It's allowed me to have opportunities that I would, wouldn't would have otherwise, and uh, I could do this for a career, for a living. I just graduated college last year, so the fact that I could do music as a living, is, it's just a blessing. Now, Joseph, I have a very, very important question. Right. I've been dying to ask you this. Okay. Do you do your own taxes? Well, 
Well, my, my mom helps me out. I okay. guess I don't know how that pertains to. Okay. 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 Well, if you ever want to give your mom a break, I could do your taxes. Oh, okay, really? Not to boast, but I am the second best amateur accountant in the state of California. Oh, that sounds promising. Okay. Watch your pocket protector, Jack Douglas, gunning for you. Let's move on to some viewer questions. Okay, let's do that, yeah. This is from Eric A on Twitter. What advice do you have for people trying to make it as musicians? Good question. Just to make sure that it's what they want to do and if they want to do it to work your, I mean, excuse my language, to work your ass off for it. Yeah. yeah. Lily L on Facebook. Uh, who is your celebrity crush? We're all dying to know. Celebrity crush. Have you heard of Cher Lloyd? She's from the UK. I love Cher. Oh my goodness. She yeah. was so good in Moonstruck and no. she had that song where she was on a boat singing. No, she I, was great. I don't think I don't think that's a Cher. I mean Cher Lloyd. She's getting kind of old though. Joseph, yeah. would you be so kind as to play another song for us? Let's do it. You know what? Let's oh, let's do that. Terrific. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, my music presents Joseph Vincent. Here's another song off the album, it's called Sweet Talk. Oh yeah. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I saw you walking down the street. I think I finally get to meet my lady for the very first time. Myself to keep those legs on know they get me weak and taking no you can't be denied but here's my chance right now you be my girl somehow Joseph, yeah. are you ready to take the Intern 2 challenge? I mean, sure, just as long as it doesn't involve any more flowcharts. Hmm. Trust me, this will be 10 times as exciting as any flowchart. May I present the Tai Tai? Let's do it. Now, the My Music staff threatened to ban me if I did another Tai Tai challenge, but they're all preoccupied fighting with each other, so I'd figure I could just sneak this in. Way to take a stand, Intern 2. Thank you. Three, two, one, tie tie. Oh, look at you. Uh, you. Look like a sheep trying to put on a sweater. It's just so awkward. Look at this. Right, yeah, how many ties do you put on, Rockstar? 
Do you know how many I put on in a day? More than three. And I'm done already. Oh, that was quick. Really fast. Yeah. Right. Well, I've had a little practice. Uh. You were a little more formidable than um, Mr. Choi. Oh no. Yeah, it just oh, now, no. now that's it's that's just hopeless. There we go. Well, thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you. It's a final question. It's time for the final question. And this week's final question is from the Harley Hatchie 2, who asked, "If you had a time-traveling demon unicorn, that could fly you anywhere, anytime. Where would you go? I guess I would go to Australia in 1985. Okay, why? Australia is an awesome country, and uh, 1985 is just the first year that popped into my head. I guess Back to the Future. How would you plan on stowing your demon flying unicorn? I mean, that would be a nightmare for customs. Uh, I don't know. You need to think these through, I buddy. Need to figure it out, man. Logistics. Make sure to leave your final question suggestion in the YouTube comments below. Personally, I would love to see some questions regarding manila envelopes. That'd be neato. Oh, and the question with the most thumbs up will be asked. It's a final question. Follow us around the web to find out about future guests and for a chance to have your questions featured on the show. We'll see you next week on My Music Presents. Take us out, Joseph Vincent. This is the end slate song. Thank you for playing along. And along with me. Why don't you subscribe to my channel, please? I would appreciate it. Also, if you checked out some my music stuff, there's videos everywhere all around me. So click on two or three. Please.